Hey guys and welcome to today's video. So in today's video I thought I would show you my fossil office or basically the part of my parents garage that I was allowed to set up and basically put all my fossils. But um, all it is is I've just bought a table and it just means it's separate from everything else so I can just focus on my fossils when I want to um, as I am doing it for my dissertation but also just for fun of course. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoy! So this is what it looks like, it's nothing that amazing, it's just somewhere to put them all. So I've got, well I've got my hard hat there for when I'm climbing cliffs and then these boxes here are to put the sorted ones because all of these fossils here are relevant to my dissertation and I need to like sort them, clean them up and then put them in there. So if you look here we've got ones which clearly have a fossil in, you can see all the ribs there, but just need a bit of work to get it out, so like chipping away the excess material, but I'll do videos on how to clean up fossils and as and when I do I'll show you guys. Um, and then so in these crates there's just more fossils, more fragments, They're, most of them are wrapped up to protect them and <laughs> yeah look at all my toothbrushes, <laughs> aren't they funny, just to brush away stuff, but um, yeah, and then underneath the table we've got more crates of fossils, so all of these are rocks um, waiting to be sorted. These are the boulders I lugged back across the beach, um, mainly because I need like big specimens to make like thin sections and to slice up the layers to look into them, but if I come round I can show you what's in them, they're pretty cool rocks. So here you can see it's a massive cross section of a huge ammonite. Just going across there. So the ammonite is a harposterous ammonite, and you can see that from the keels and the venter type. But um, yeah, so this is like sliced in half, like through the middle of the ammonite, and that's what you see. So technically, if I got a chisel and I hacked off the top of here, or actually that side, um, it would reveal a lovely part of an ammonite. But um, no, these boulders here will probably have other uses. But yeah, so there's the backpack that carries them all. It's still surviving somehow. And then we have the table. So I got this table off Gumtree, isn't it amazing? Like it cost me £40 and it's like got a proper metal frame and then a lovely wooden top, which means it can take the weight of the bad boys. So um, I'll start with the little one. So this is a pretty cool ammonite I found down in Charmouth. So you can see all the suture lines beautifully. They literally look like leaves or trees. So gorgeous. And then there's loads of like little ones around it. But that needs some cleaning up. I need to like clean up the edges a bit and into the middle of it a bit more. Um, then this one, you may have seen on my Instagram, this is a mega lytoceros. So I'm going to do a video on this one by itself. So I won't talk too much about that one, but it's massive and it weighs a ton. But it's pretty amazing. And then these ones here on this piece of newspaper, these are all my recent finds. So I need to basically bag them up, label them, put them into the... Um, I have like a catalogue for my dissertation, so I'm going to like label them all up, take the nice photos of them, but uh, yeah, and so I love these ones, so these are Gryphea, also known as the devil's toenail, because I just think they look funny, but um, yes, I've got two of those, but these are just some more bits and bobs, ta-da, oh and then this little one here, funny enough, so this fragment of an ammonite here, is the same species as the big one. They're both lytoceruses, but that one's not a mega one, obviously. Um, but yeah, so this is my <laughs> fossil office. So lots of work to be done, but it's all good fun. So that's all I've got for you today. I do hope you enjoyed this video. Um, if you did, please like and subscribe. Um, but let me know in the comments if there's any other videos you're dying to see. Um, if you saw anything in this video that you were like, oh, I'd love to know more about that, just drop a comment and I'll do my best to film them. Um, but I'm going to film a Megalitoceros video ASAP because that is such a cool fossil. But um, apart from that, I will see you guys next time and thank you for watching.